Welcome back everyone, I'm Yurik Gibbs. We're going to be playing a brand new game today, Theater of the Absurd. And uh, basically someone has been asking me to play this game for a while now. Polite, persistent, and I thought, you know what, I'll give it a shot. Played it about for four or five minutes, loved it. Moved it to the top of the list, so here we are. We're going to go ahead and play. This is just the standard edition. Uh, let's just look at the options here quickly. I just want to make sure I've got the volume. Yeah, music's down. Everything else looks okay. So yeah, so Theory of the Absurd. Uh, from what I've seen, it's a little scary. But uh, let's go ahead and play. Mrs. Frost, thank you for coming on such short notice. I presume that you've studied the Habsburg Cube? I know the legend of the Habsburg Cube. A legend no longer, Mrs. Frost. Oh, no. I don't believe it. And now confirm for me, Mrs. Frost. Is it indeed? The real Habsburg cube? Uh, no. I'm sorry. It's a fake. What? It can't be fake! Give me that word, piece of glass! I'm ruined! Rage quit. Oh, no. Thank you. Supposed to read this? Dr. Corvus has summoned you to his remote castle to authenticate a legendary artifact. It's creepy. In a fit of rage, he sna he smashed the cube, releasing the demon. Now the soul of his daughter is in grave peril. She must be saved from the dark force that is consuming her. Nom nom. Two hours later. Should I trust him? I don't know what you guys think. He's trying to get in here. Uh, sure, why not? Don't open the door. Oh my god. My arm. Do as I say. Oh. <laughs> A little jumpy here. Uh, somehow your arm has acquired strange powers. You can use it to your... Use this to your advantage. Click on the hand button to find clues and unlock special abilities. Already loving it. I have a super powerful hand. Or arm or whatever. Approach the cage. Alrighty then. I shall do that. Uh, actually, just let me do something here quickly. I don't know if the voice I'll might be a little bit quiet, so I'm going to turn that up just a touch. Uh, approach the cage. Please. Open the cage. Sure, honey. I'll, I'll open the cage. <gasps> Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, no! Can you help me? I think there's some medicine up here somewhere. Medicine? I need it badly. I feel so sick. No, oh, she doesn't look too this healthy. This girl is possessed. I need to help her. Quickly. There you go. To see your current task, open your book by clicking the... Book button. Look at the size of this arrow here. This is great. Collectibles. Oh, that's interesting. Search the bell tower for the little girl's medicine. So it begins. I never suspected that Dr. Corvus would have the real Hasburg cube hidden away in his old castle. Now the monster within has escaped and his daughter, Bethany, has been left in grave danger. She's safe in the bell tower. That bell must possess some strange power. 
see any clues in my notes I find in this journal. And that thunder noise is creeping me out. So let's see, we've got two jump scares, we've got some thunder, we've got a demon. This game is creepy. Alright, let's go let's start to gather things. Hear no evil? Sure. Collect I'll this. take that. Oh, another collectible. The water of Horus can heal any ailment, dispel any magic, and even quell demonic infection for a time. Hmm. Okay, I'm not sure if I'm going to read all these, because it looks like there's a whole whack of them. But, uh, definitely want to read some of them, or a lot of them. If I had a cable, I could escape. But I need to help that little girl. It won't be complete until I find all the pieces. I like how there's voice for all these things. It's kind of neat. I know some of you are like, oh, I don't like the voice, but this seems not too bad. Oh, we can go there. But let's look oh, there yet. Let's see what else we have. Someone removed the call button. Oh, for an elevator. Find each circle within the scene. Oh, this is a different kind of puzzle here. Let's see what we got here. Oh, okay, face is a face. Oh, I like how it clicks in like that. Uh, let's put that there. Looks like an arm to me. Finger. Horns. More horns. Demon horns. Pelican or something. Ooh, that goes here. Yeah, I really like how it slides into place. It's, uh, it's nice. I think I got rid of the easy ones, didn't I? Maybe I did. Uh, I don't know about this one. Oh wait, here it is. Should I do the last one? Um, oh, here it is. Cool, no hints needed. Whoa, what is this all about? <laughs> Take this, my child. Take what? Oh, a ring. Okay, cool. This bell looks broken. Let's go back to the girl. Oh, we can't. Uh, here no evil. Cool. This looks like we need the other two. Oh no, I can't go to the girl. Hello. Help me. Uh, hi there. Is that Bethany? Ooh. <laughs> Bethany! We found the picture of Bethany. Cool. Hi. This girl is possessed. I need to help her. Quickly. Okay. Let's get out of here before she goes all demon-eyed. Oh my goodness, that thunder is creepy. Uh, looks like we need something on his a forehead. Gargoyle. It looks like it needs a key. I like this voice actress. She's very dramatic. It's cool. Demon smoke. Only demonic powers can create or dispel it. Uh, okay. Oh, a disc thing. Jade ring. I don't know how many I need. Remember to use your hand thing for clues. Search the carpet. Wow, that's kind of creepy. Oh, here we go. We got some clicky clicky. performing a rite of possession. Right of Usually people want demons out of them, not in. Wow, that's a, this game's going to have a lot of voice, wow. Okay, Jade Ring, okay, there's another one in here somewhere. Right there, ooh, the music's kind of nice. A uh, yin and a yang. Uh, let's see here. Everything kind of blends in here a bit. really know what that was. Gargoyle key, okay, I know where that goes too. Maybe I'm going to get more than one thing here. Uh, empty bowl. This light is super bright. Where's the empty bowl? Hmm. <gasps> Clock, a wrench, and an empty bowl. Wishbone, no. There's herb. Herbs. Empty bowl. 
old handcuffs. Right there. Spectacles. There. Arrow. Yeah, this is a pretty tough scene to be starting off with. It's just a little washed out. It's, uh... I'm sure it's part of the effect. That was actually quite a clever wrench. Okay, so what do we have here? Clock, empty bowl. Yay. Yeah. Hmm. There's the bowl. Crowbar! I want you! Why won't you come with me? We'll go on adventures. A clock, an arrow. And a yin yang. Hmm, there's an arrow. So we need a clock and a yin yang. Uh, I don't know. There's a yin yang. We'll go ahead and head to the last one. Oh wow. Nicely hid. Oh wow, three things. Oh my goodness, that's great. Golden eye, gargoyle key. Let's go ahead and do the gargoyle. Right on his forehead there. Ooh, his green eyes. Hey, I'll take you. Oh no, not you. Help me. I need to get out of here. Wrong click. Be in front of you. Speak no evil. Okay. No. Where was the... Here it was. Oh, maybe I have to zoom in first. Won't be complete until I find all the pieces. Did I have it? Yay! Click the puzzle help in the upper right for instructions. Rotate the rings to complete a face. Oh no. They rotate together. Uh... Find out the matching piece before I... Looks like... There, maybe? Whoa. Wait a minute. There? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Uh... Whew. Hooey. Oh wait, I see the nose now. We did it! Ooh! Take a button and I'll take this thing here. Phial of the water of Horus, said to purify the soul. Why is it locked in a bell tower? Good question something horrible out there. I need to escape by another route. Alright, so let's put the button here, I guess. That's creepy. Whoa, what is this all about? This is one creepy elevator. Whoa. Uh, what else do we have here? Music is lovely, actually. <laughs> Number four. Monkey. Dragonfly. I thought I saw one already. There it is. Frog. Horned skull. <clears throat> hmm. Checking the outside edges here. Okay, so what do we have here? Monkey, that's probably the last monkey we need. Uh, there's that one. So we have fire and a corkscrew. Uh, hmm. I'm not exactly sure what the corkscrew is going to look like. 
Or the fire, for that matter. Nothing there. Question mark. It reminds me of the Riddler. So I don't see it on the outside edges here. Corkscrew and a fire. That looks like bread. There's a camel. That looks like a fire there, no? No such luck? I have no idea. Oh my goodness, that's brutal. Oh no. Now we have to find fire. Let's see if we can get it before the hint timer adds up. And as you can tell, I play these for fun. I'm not overly concerned about using too many hints or anything like that. Playing them to enjoy myself and hopefully entertain a few people. Still don't know where the fire is. It's gonna be one of those things that once I see it, it's gonna be like, oh, okay, I'm sorry, you missed that. Oh, wow, in the eyeball. Oh my god. <laughs> when I get to keep it too. Three items. Uh, oh, it goes down, does it? I can use this cable to escape if I can cut it free. Cut it free. Alright, let's go ahead and do the doll here. Oh, they float! Oh, she's gonna be free! Yay! Help me! Uh, here's the... Take this. It will calm the demon inside you. Thank you. It won't last long though. Reminds me of uh, Bioshock. Because you have the monster in you as well. What? Yes. So it would seem. Here, take this rope. Maybe you can use it. Thank you for the rope. You got a magic bell rope. Oh, not just any old rope. Uh, why is this all glowy up here? What's happening? Is that me? Scarlet, Scarlet Frost. Frost. To save that me, you must find four bell relics. The rope you have is Place it on the bell now. This reminds me of a play. It's actually quite impressive. <laughs> there we go. Yank it. Power. Receive this power. Use it to defeat the demon. But use it carefully. Tell me this does not feel like Bioshock with the power in your hands. The plasmid? I think that's what they were called. Use your new ability to clear the demon smoke. Oh, sweet. Okay. Uh, where was that demon smoke? In here. Demon smoke. Only demonic powers can create or dispel it. Use it. Wow. Oh, I love this. This is great. Oh. These are the tools of a demon summoner. All right, let's get going then. God, the music's great. Fleur de lis. Fleur de lis. Wow, so this is crazy stuff. vial. There's the magnet and the swordfish. We'll go hit the swordfish. Oh, there it is. Four items, folks. You get four items. <laughs> Alright, uh, <laughs> I'm so excited here. What am I going to do with all this stuff? I don't 
don't know. There's something else over here. A rope. I could escape through the window if I had a strong cape. Oh, the cable. Okay, okay. Yeah, the cable isn't here. There we go. Uh, I don't it know. looks like the bell is protecting Bethany for now, but I must find all the bell pieces to save her. Okay. Her time is running out. Let's use this cable here. All right, let's exit the bell tower. <laughs> she punched it. Here goes. Begins your search for the bell relics. Find all the bell relics to save Bethany. Find a way to the library. Okay, folks, we're going to quit it here. Not quit, but we're going to stop the video here. And we'll see you in the next chapter. Thanks for watching Theater of the Absurd. I'm loving it. It, uh, it It's amazing so far. <laughs> I'll talk to you soon. I'm your Gibbs. Bye for now.